What up guys? Today we're going to be discussing who I think this year's NBA Rookie of the Year is. So, stay tuned. Okay, so as many of you know, the heated battle for the Rookie of the Year this year is between Donovan Mitchell of the Jazz and Ben Simmons of the Sixers. So both these players are 21. Mitchell played two years at Louisville and then entered the draft, got drafted last year. Ben Simmons played one year at LSU, got drafted, and then had to sit out last year due to injury. And so this was his first year playing, so he's a rookie. So the NBA defines rookie as the first season you play. So according to them, Ben Simmons is a rookie. So we are not going to discuss that. We're just going to debate of these two players that the NBA considers rookie, who is having the best season. Okay, so we'll just go over some numbers real quick. Their points, rebounds, assists. This season, during the regular season, Mitchell averaged 20 and a half points per game. Ben Simmons, 15.8. Rebounds, Mitchell 3.7, Simmons 8.1. Assists, Mitchell 3.7, Simmons 8.2. Mitchell broke the NBA rookie record of three-pointers made. That was previously set by Damian Lillard. I'm pretty sure he also set the record of attempts. He had many 20-point games this season. Well, on the other hand, Simmons was definitely a facilitator. A lot of people are calling him the prince to LeBron's king, as in he is the next LeBron, basically. Play similar to LeBron. A lot of people debate on their, their different players. Mitchell scores a lot, and Simmons is more does everything. His stat sheet is filled, kind of like LeBron's. I'm glad that both these players are on good teams. With Simmons on the Sixers and Mitchell on the Jazz, I'm, I'm sure that they both have a big part in playing the reason why they're so good but it's just fun to be able to watch them compete on good teams to help them to showcase their talents and then right now they're both in the playoffs they're both on the verge of making the second round Mitchell's the first rookie since Michael Jordan to score over 100 points in his first four games and Ben Simmons was the first rookie since Magic Johnson in 1980 to record a triple-double in the playoffs so both of these players are amazing they both do amazing things I think it's been fun to watch the debate of everybody on who should win it. I saw a tweet not too long ago about someone saying, Ben Simmons or Donovan Mitchell for Rookie of the Year? Who cares? You guys are debating an award that Michael Carter Williams won. And if anybody knows who Michael Carter Williams is, not surprised if you don't, but if you do, you know his career has been very mediocre. So to compare Ben Simmons and Donovan Mitchell's rookie year to the likes of Michael Carter Williams, it kind of puts it all into perspective. These players, whether they win the award or not, are going to go on and have great careers, in my opinion. All-star appearances, maybe MVPs, scoring champion, they're both amazing. The way that Donovan Mitchell can score with ease is, is amazing as a rookie. Ben Simmons, the way he facilitates, the way he can do everything with such ease as well, is amazing. So regardless of who wins this award, they're both going to be great. So, the question who is Troppy Boy's Rookie of the Year. Sorry guys, I'm gonna hit you with the double tech, the cop-out answer. I think both should win it. I think it should be co-Rookie of the Years. I don't think it's really that big of a deal, honestly. They both have amazing seasons. You have great arguments for both sides, so why not just give them both the award? Grant Hill and Jason Kidd were co-Rookie of the Years. Why not just throw co-Rookie of the Year out? I don't see a problem with it. Whoever wins it, congrats. But in my opinion, co-rookie of the year. That's all I got. Leave a comment on what you think, and let's duke this out. Until next time, peace.